Hello everybody. In this video I've done a lot of patching, a lot of welding, a lot of bondoing, a lot of sanding. I showed what I could of it. I hope you enjoy this video. Let me know what you think in the comments below. And I'll show you a little bit more up close at the end of the video. See, so I cut it out here, uh, cut this out here. I showed you that. Uh, welded it in. I have filled all that. The door is sanded. I welded it fairly solid, but there was a few holes that ended up getting filler in them. That door turned out better than the driver's side. And I believe it was a better door to begin with. This one at the deepest might have it an eighth inch. It's not bad. There's quite a bit I have to do right here. All right. So I've made this patch. There's still, and I made the rocker fit out of another old rocker. Still got a lot that I gotta do to it. But I'll show you some more once I've uh, got this bent to how I can do it. Which what I'm liable to do is just cut and weld, cut and weld, because I don't have any way to bend that curve that bend so back in a second all right so this side I had I had to put it back on the same as I had to that side but I had this side that's how it looks it's the original one and this is how this one looks and I still have to Put something over this I'll do that but this is a piece of hood and that's a piece of rocker but it's the center it's the center of a Malibu the one I cut the back of this car out of it's welded to this here it's welded here I can pack that full seam sealer through here You'll barely be able to notice that. If you even can. I made it have a curve in it. I made this out of, you know, just cutting straight angles and 
welding it. And I can grind that a little better. But there you go. So the next part of this, I'll grind. I'll I'll grind this. I also have to make a patch because I found some rust right here. I'll grind all that, and I'll finish body filler in it, and I'll show you some of that. Still got a, a little low spot. Alright, so uh, this is the end of the video, I guess. So I'll show you a little bit of what I did. I had to replace that much of that. I showed that in the video. Uh, it's not exactly factory, but it's there. That's more than I could say before, because it wasn't there before. I want to go back and work the inside of the wheel wells on both sides a little bit to get rid of the jaggedness of it but the quarters are pretty much as good as they're going to get i am going to block the car once i'm waiting until i have everything sanded and all the welding and body work done there's still a little bit to do here and there i want to have everything sanded i want to prime the whole car and i want to block it so it's not going to be a perfect paint job but I am going to do a little bit better than I was originally going to do I do not want DA swirls in my paint 
I don't care if the bodywork ends up being a little bit choppy because it, it more than likely will. Uh, I just don't want it to have swirl marks and stuff in it. Next video will uh, probably be me making that inner panel, panel to go from here to the trunk floor. Uh, they cut it out. I don't have one that's worth using. So I'm just going to make patches to go from there to up in there. From the back to the front on both sides. And then I want to make the bottom of the wheel wells to go from here down to that and I don't know how that's supposed to be I have no idea none of them out here has one I don't want to look at somebody else's car and bother them with that so uh, I'm just going to make an approximation of what I think that's supposed to look like and take a uh, scientific wild ass guess and just kind of go with it so, anyway, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Uh, let me know in the comments below if you got to the end, I guess. And uh, I'll see you again next time. Bye.